Sonia Lewinertz and Robert Lewinertz. Uh, the first Junior Grand Prix season, second event. They were eighth in Ostrava in week number two. 53.37 is their best free program score, hoping to top that right now as they will skate the overture from City Lights. Sonia and Robert Lewinertz from Germany. Another brother and sister team, this time in the Pierce competition, and that, I think, much stronger than their performance that they had in Estrava at Czechskate a few weeks ago. Yeah, you can see it starting to come together. It's just mileage, it really is. Mileage meaning, of course, time on the ice, you know, practice sessions, co competing, gaining experience of course being a brother or sister probably is a great asset here they go home and talk about it they may even you know try some lifts in the backyard who knows but this brilliant interpretation at the start of the program from robert being the charlie chaplin character that was the theme used for the composition of this their free skate and the team just demonstrating a little bit more quality in the elements that awarded a level three there in the split twist 
Getting key features as we look now to the double loop Euler double Sako. They did do double axle side by side at the first Grand Prix, simplifying and that paying off here with better success than their first junior Grand Prix assignment. Good and start to that lift, Mark, and mm -hmm. then it just came down a little early, but... And you can see here now the attempt at the side-by-side -side triple toes. I, I just a demonstration that's still early development. She popping, Robert going down. They're in the good hands, capable hands of coach Rico Rex, who has been there, done that, and they're eager to just pass that on to the next generation. When you look at them sitting on the couch, you know, really de dealing with young people starting, you know, a discipline which requires growth and strength to, you know, start to stabilize that. But there, it's a good time to start. They've got the basics there in pair skating as they get their strength and stability. You'll start to see more speed, of course, and control. And having been here and seeing the, the likes of the Australians and the Americans who are first and second after the short program, it just unquantifiably inspiring and beyond this I don't know their next international assignment or perhaps domestic event in Germany but following this competition they will be ignited in their inspiration to push for either better program components yeah and when you see their your competitors you start to say okay all right I want to be that good now you start to address some of the issues maybe it's more ice time maybe it's you know, being a little bit more aggressive, more skating skills, all the types of things you need to close that gap, you know, if you are inspired, you know, and mm. if you have the time, it's, there's a lot of ifs in there, and if you have enough facilities and enough ice time to be able to do it. And they train in Berlin with Rico Rex, and you have to assume that it's good setup in Berlin, to assume then also with Rico, a coach who's been there and lived it himself he certainly knows what will need to be done he's showcased that quality as a skater and so he'll at least if not available all the time we don't know if their academic pursuits prevent them training as much as they would like but they certainly know oh, well they're in the safe hands and you can see rico you know reaching out to um robert and just patting him on the head and you know just giving them some guidance and you can see the calmness around rico in how he handles a team you know really nicely done Let's take a look at the free program scores for Sonia and Robert. Season's best at 63.05, and that will move this team currently into first place. For the 101.76, <laughs> they got a brother and sister half hug on that, <laughs> <laughs> that occasion. Right. First team to top 100. Yeah, and they look satisfied. Very happy, yeah, for sure. 